I feel like with each bundle, Riot is trying to play how much can I get away with. Because every new bundle, it seems like we're just paying more for less. Because the recent one, we had the Xenofang, right? It costs 60 bucks. 60 bucks for three skins. A Vandal, a Ghost, and a Knife. 60 bucks. And then you, you're probably going to pay another $150 to upgrade all the guns and have all the variants. So that shit is expensive. It's hella expensive. Granted, the skins look cool, but still fucking 60 bucks for three skins. That's a lot of money. I know a lot of, a lot of guys ate that shit up. You know, I, I fucking did, stupidly enough. You know, the skin looked cool, so, so we'll give him a pass. So I'm like, we'll give him a pass. Let's see where Riot is headed now. Then comes the Valentine's Day, and what do they release? Riot goes like, fuck you guys. Fuck your replay system. Fuck the fun uh, custom games. We're just gonna embrace the cringiest side of Valorant community, the fucking E-Daters, and they release a duos, they package, whatever the fuck that is, a bundle, for 20 bucks, for 20 bucks, you'll get absolutely nothing, nada, no fucking skins, just some sprays, just some banners, that's all, and a cringy title that says duo, and a couple of femboy titles, don't ask me how I know, right? I know. I just know. <laughs> All right. But yeah, so for 20 bucks, you get absolutely nothing. And the funny thing is that this shit goes two way, right? So if you buy it and your duo doesn't buy it, then to me, it's like the, you know, the Amaranth moderator trying to high five Amaranth, but then she doesn't high five her back. And that's the analogy uh, for this, for this bundle. If you buy it and your duo doesn't buy it. And, and if you're a girl and you buy it and your duo doesn't buy it, you should have dumped that guy's ass way back, you know. Because cause at this point, he should already he should have already bought you 10 Funko Pops. He should be already paying for your Discord Nitro every month. So yeah, you should have dumped his ass. So, and... <laughs> Man, 20 fucking bucks. Um, 20 bucks. 20 bucks is a lot of money, especially where I come from, where the currency is useless much like Kingdom Credit in Valorant. 20 bucks, you can get 15 kebabs for 20 bucks where I come from. For 20 bucks, you can get two hoodies and a pair of joggers. And if your pocket's a little bit wider, you can just get a top-notch hoodie and get hella mad bitches, you know. Not an e-kitten who's probably gonna cheat on you with some diamond dude and, <laughs> you know, <laughs> what's funny is as a bronze to gold player, our worst nightmare is having our kittens, e-kitten stolen by a diamond player, you know, that's our worst nightmare. Actually, on a, on a serious note though, if you don't own a car where I come from, you're pretty much a nobody, so as a 25 year old dude who doesn't even know how to drive a car, you can, you can pretty much imagine what my love, what my love, love, Fucking hell, what my love life looks like, right? <laughs> it's just me and my hand, bro. Just me and my hand. Uh, all the more reason why I play Valorant. Um, but yeah, speaking of e-kittens. Um, what, what was I talking I got a little bit fucking sidetracked. Uh, coming back to the topic. 20 fucking bucks for nothing. Don't buy it. Not worth it. Now, moving on. VCT team capsules. I hate this one. The reason why I hate it is because they call it team capsules. These are not team capsules. These aren't team capsules. Team capsules are the shit you buy and use to customize your other shit. You know, like in CS, you get a, you get a, I don't know, like a Kenny S autograph and then you slap that shit across your op and now your op looks insanely good. You know, you got aimbot on that shit. That's capsule. Now this shit is just a default classic reskin 33 times and being sold $20 each of those reskins. That's insanely expensive, and then you're gonna spend 20 more bucks on Radionites to unlock the kill banner. It's not worth it. Now, I do want to support my 100 Thieves boys. Guys, guys, we're having a rough patch here. We're, we're not making it to the champions, but my boy Asuna, I want to support him. But but you know who else I want to support? I want to support my crippling fentanyl addic addiction and my family of five. I need to support them. So it's not gonna be you, 100 Thieves, I'm sorry. Um, actually, let me look. Their, their banner has plus RR. Now that I'm thinking about it, I might actually, I might actually buy it because if you look at my match history, it's just been minus RR all the fucking time. You know, negative RR minus RR. So I might actually buy this one. Um, so yeah, super expensive, not worth it. They all look the same. Just don't buy it. Don't buy it. There, I would have, 
I would have done it a little bit different, honestly. They should have done it a little bit different. What they could have done is they could have released a classic for five bucks. Now, the, the thing about this classic is that um, it's, it's stickerable, right? And then what you can do is you can release the capsules and I buy the capsule and attach it to my classic. Now my classic has another variant, which is, for example, 100 Thieves variants. I'm gonna equip the 100 Thieves and now I'm supporting my boys for two bucks. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, or then I buy, let's say, Sentinel ones, right? Uh, for two bucks and now I have both 100 Thieves and Sentinels as a variant to my classic. That would have been fire, but they didn't do it like that. That would have sold really, really well. I mean, I know this one's going to sell really, really well too, because Sentinels have a lot of dick riders. Um, so yeah, anyways, um, yeah, overpriced, garbage, don't buy. Um, they all look the same to me. I don't know. The red ones especially, they just look the same. Um, so yeah, uh, there was a little bit of rent of me on Valorant and there's a lot of things wrong with Valorant and if this video gets 10 likes I'm gonna make more videos especially if this video gets 10 likes I'm gonna make a video on on why Buggy the Clown is a daddy material thank you for watching please please support like and subscribe so I can also support my my boys over at 100 Thieves Austin on my goat